I've had the great opportunity in researching other projects to spend a lot of time with some top business leaders and also some top leaders in other fields, uh, some top commanders in the British and American armies, some top surgeons. People have organized you know, large groups of people acting well. And what they tend to do is divide their, uh, their approach into two parts. Backstage, they're really open to evidence and information. People can brief them, they'll listen, they'll express uncertainty to their closest friends. Then once they make a decision, they're, uh, they're absolute and confident. Not cocky, but they express a matter of fact confidence. The people who only do that second stage, who appear to, think of the people who appear to be like Steve Jobs. Mm -hmm. I'm going to be arrogant and I'm going to be insistent. Usually they're wrong. They're just flailing and showing off like a teenage boy strutting and pretending to be uh, tougher and more knowledgeable than he is. So you need the two stages. Quietly, maybe when nobody's looking, you learn. Then once you do know, for the people who need to follow you, you're matter of fact. Right. The trick there for that second stage, and again I get this more from the military people than business ones, though some of the successful business ones have it, is not to either lean forward or to lean back when you're leading. Uh, uh, in, a, in a situation of, of violence, like a potential danger on the street, uh, people tend to lean back like, ooh, stay away from me, man, or oh, I'm scared. Mm -hmm. Or they lean forward say, what are you saying? Very aggressive. Right. The people who stand utterly calmly in the middle, neither forward nor back, tend to be left alone. Or they tend to, people quietly, they listen to their quiet words. Interesting. Yeah, because we interviewed Daniel Kahneman, uh, author of Think Fast, Think Slow, and he was saying very similar things. He said, if you know, system two thinking is your Im immediate gut response mm -hmm. versus system one, but you've got to use both systems, Correct. not one in isolation to the other. Someone like Kahneman really has it nailed. And I suppose the thing that what a good business or other leader can do is take those two stages, but do them at different times. One should be in public, one can be in private.